Five is a mid-sized construction materials and infrastructure investment group with a market cap of 2.6 billion rand, a dividend yield of 1.8% and a price earnings ratio of eight. It operates in Africa, the Middle East and Eastern Europe and has focused on toll roads and power projects in recent years. Group five, where are we going with this story? We have been hammered. Yep. along with the rest of the construction sector from a share price perspective. Yep. So their tactic, which was what we were referring to earlier, they did toll roads where you do the project to actually build the road and then you get a concession to do the tolling thereafter and you get yourself repaid that way. Number of projects like that in Eastern Europe. And then in the local environment, like most of the other construction companies, they want to be involved with the power station build out. Only one or two people can get the big coal fired stations and the nuclear projects. But all these renewable things they've been partial bidders for. So they get good general work and they work hard and I think it's a good company, well run. They've put some major feet wrong, unfortunately, in recent years, buying into the materials and aggregates and sand and quarrying business. And they're trying to get out of that now. That was a 750 million rand disaster. Big capital misallocation mistake on that front. Yes, they have actually sold that now. Have I, and so that, that, that's Don't worry about Paul, he's usually behind the times. <laughs> So yeah, so they have got out of that uh, that division, um, and you know, looking really good at these levels, uh, maybe a small bounce um, off these low levels here for Group Five. A small bounce. This sounds interesting. We could be getting somewhere <laughs> positive. Anything else that you want Look, to throw? They're under to? cautionary currently, which I'm not quite sure what that is about. I know that they have had some reorganisation of their empowerment uh, shareholding. And they've got quite a big holding by the government pension funds in them as well. You know, there have been some crazy rumblings about the state wanting to have a construction company. I'm not quite sure why, whether it's to build, you know, government houses or whether it's to build projects. But that seems a bit of a nuts idea. But I have heard some people indicating that maybe that's what the cautionary is about. But I can't really see it. Um, all things considered, a well-run company like the CEO, Mike Upton but it suffers from the same industry problems. Now, I want to throw forward to one potential element. Could we not see some corporate action given that share prices are so depressed? Is this not ripe pickings for some consolidation? Um, you would think so. Uh, the problem is uh, the amount of liquidity and cash that these companies have got on their balance sheets and whether they can do a purchase of 11 billion, 12 billion, et cetera, going and, and, and more. Um, so that would be something that you would have to look at uh, maybe an outsider comes in. So they don't have those war chests on balance sheet. These balance sheets are, are quite beleaguered. Could I use that terminology? Yes. And so I don't think there's anyone really with massive cash that can go in and, and buy that. But maybe an asset manager from overseas or a BlackRock, maybe there there will be enough funds. But locally, I don't think there's enough What funds. about BlackRock as an option? Well, they're a global asset manager. And I think from time to time, they may look at things like this. But I would imagine they would prefer to be where they feel safe from a far distance. I mean, there are global construction companies, uh, you know, like uh, Bouygues and, uh, you know, the big French players and people of that nature. I don't really think they're likely to come up begging because they're even more hammered at the moment than, uh, than we are down here. So this construction story is just not and a There are some one. smaller companies, which we haven't discussed today, which are themselves doing it with the odd sort of merger and acquisition. But I don't think so. This is the environment where you can build rather than buy. In terms of Group 5, hot or not? Not. Hot or not? Sadly not. 